button to subscribe my channel and also click the bell icon to get notifications of all my latest uploads. Thank you. Hello friends, welcome to my channel. In this challenging problem series, we discuss various challenging problems related to the topic of IIT JE and NDA syllabus. Let us discuss another challenging question from integration. Since this is a complex integral, let us simplify it first. So i is equals to x square minus 1 divided by this is x square plus 1. This is under root of x raised to the power 4 plus 1. From numerator, I will be taking x square outside. So this will be x square 1 minus 1 upon x square x square 1 minus 1 upon x square and from this I will take x outside so this is x x plus 1 upon x from this I will take x square common so this is x square x square plus 1 upon x square so this is x square 1 minus 1 upon x square this is x this is a square root of x square so I can take x outside of this square root and I will be getting x square x plus 1 upon x and this is x square plus 1 upon x square this x square and this x square will go and I will be having 1 minus 1 upon x square in the numerator and in denominator this will be x plus 1 upon x square root of x square plus 1 upon x square can be written as x plus 1 upon x whole square minus 2 so our integral reduces to this form this is integral of dx and we need to calculate this integral so let us put x plus 1 upon x is equals to p now if i differentiate both sides 1 upon x square dx will be dt and if I substitute this value in the given integral, our integral will become this is 1 minus 1 upon x square dx. In the numerator, this will be t. In denominator, this is t under root of this is t square minus 2. Now let us substitute again. Let us take t is equals to square root 2 secant theta. In that case, dt will be root 2 differentiation of sec theta will be sec theta tan theta so this is sec theta tan theta d theta so in place of dt i will be writing this so let us substitute this value in the integral our integral will become this is dt in place of dt it will be root 2 secant theta tan theta d theta and in the denominator this was t under root of t square minus 2 so t was root 2 sec theta this is root 2 sec theta and under root of t square minus 2 t square means square of this this is 2 secant square theta minus 2 now let us simplify this one this root 2 and root 2 will go this secant theta and secant theta will go i am left with tan theta d theta and in denominator if i take root 2 out this is secant square minus 1 so i can write this as this is 2 this is secant square minus 1 and secant square minus 1 is tan square theta so this can be written as tan theta d theta here this is root 2 and this is tan square theta square root of tan square theta that will be tan theta so this tan theta and tan theta will go and I am left with integral of d theta upon root 2 and this will be 1 upon root 2 theta plus c and the value of theta will write from here t is equals to root 2 sec theta so this is t upon root 2 secant inverse this value is equals to theta so this value will be 1 upon root 2 theta is secant inverse t upon root 2 plus c and in place of t i will be substituting x plus 1 upon x so integral is equals to 1 upon root 2 secant inverse x plus 1 upon x upon root 2 plus c 
or we can write as 1 upon root 2 secant inverse this will be x square plus 1 x will come in the denominator so root 2 x plus c comment if you have any doubt or you find a simpler way to do this question thank you for watching Thank you.